am so excited. So we have a lot going on. Yeah, we do. I get it's quite busy, but it will all make sense here in the next couple of minutes. Yes, yeah, so let's start here. Let's start yes, with this book. Yes, we'll start there. This book we got in the mail yes. from our friend David Crisp. Yes. He's the gentleman who also sent us the pumpkin spice, spice. pudding in the Not Your Nice Santa hats. That's right. We got lots of gifts from him this yes, year. Yes, he's and been shopping. So this book will literally, it has instructions on how to cast on the different stitches, okay. but then it also has patterns for some really beautiful, Ooh, there we go, socks. Look at that. Do you think you could do that, Diane? I was going to ask you the same question. No, there's no way. Um, maybe in a couple years. I got to, you know, we go. really, you know, step it up as yeah, far as we, skills, We've but. talked about, about socks before and how and how difficult. Oh, look, this they one's make me really nervous. hard. Look socks at this one. Too. Yes, yes. This so one has cute. little bobbles on there. Yeah, with the, the <laughs> snowman on there. Yes. Super cute. David, thank you. Again, thank we you. appreciate it. Yeah, we will work our way to that. Eventually. Hey, we but. do know some friends, though, at uh, Chickadee who she was making socks. Oh, that's when right. When we she went for open knit. Yes. Yeah. She could she, help us. Very good. But okay. seeing those little baubles, mm -hmm. we've been talking pom poms. Yes. And I got to know what you're up to now. Look at that. Voila. That is absolutely adorable. Um, it I goes finally with your dress. finished Maggie's scarf. I was I gonna say steal I thought it, it was for Maggie. <laughs> I might but, steal it. Yeah, it, the pom poms look fantastic. It looks so good on her. We have to take the, the yeah. lower down. So yeah, because there you yes. go. See it? Yay! Yes. I did it. I, so this was also one of the reasons that I was up late, which I think is well worth it. Because, yeah, I texted you to show you that I had finished it. Yes, and I am so happy because I feel like making something for your daughter has yeah. to be like the best experience. It was really cool. So to like teach you that, I just You're it's like happy. my proud mama moment. Yes. Here. Yes, and you know, and my husband was really supportive too. He was like, it's really, really great. And she it loves it. And I made the pom-poms too. So um, we might have to do a, a demonstration on how yes. I made these little someday. Because I have I never made, made a pom-pom as beautiful as, as oh, those. Thanks. They're always uneven and not, you know, really Easy fluffy. Goofy. So they look great. Do, 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 do. Yeah, so well done, well done. Thanks. And I'm glad that Maggie loves it. Yes, she does. And she was rocking it. You could tell with the yeah. pose. She she's, was confident. She's very excited. Okay, well, what are you working on? So I finally got to work here. Um, so I'm working on Christmas gifts, and I know that time is ticking away uh, yeah. here. Chop, so, chop. Um, can you tell what this is? It's a tree. It's Look a tree. at that. So cute. Yeah. So, so it's going to be an ornament? Um, yeah. So I kind of just make them and then let whoever I give them to, they can decide what it's uh, what they want to use it okay. for. So um, I may, I like to make them big for ornaments yeah, I like and that. stuff. So mm -hmm. um, I'm on a size eight needle okay. and then I just have the top left to do. So I'll have to cast back on mm -hmm. these edges and then I'll go up to a point okay. and then I'll, I'll put a little hook on Look, there. Loop on there. So how many do you think you're going to be able to crank out? How long did it take you to get that far? I did this in like a half hour. Oh, okay. And then I cool. was like, okay, I have to go to bed. I have to go to bed. Right. Um, but yeah, so I, I didn't work on it yesterday because of my early bedtime. Mm -hmm. So I'm hoping today to get a little bit of knitting done. I might so. steal the pattern because yes, I would also. I did bring it. I would like, you know, I, I need to get something on, on the needles here because now that I'm yeah. done. So, all right. Okay. Beautiful. I love it. So, Very good. Yes. So I am making gifts, but sometimes though, I may run out of time here. So we called in the experts. Yes. Because we have a lot of great local yarn stores. Yes. And uh, we want to see what they have. So yes. they all send in pictures of some great crafty ideas. So let's talk about it. Yes, I love uh, calling in to our local yarn stores and asking them what they have going on. So this is from Behind the Pines. Look at all the cute little things. Um, she says uh, the owner of their, Bobby, has a lot of Emma Ball items. So it's really a cute theme. I, I, a lot of the little sheep, you know, when we're thinking about knitting. So lots of great gifts. Kate, like things like, you know, cases, pouches, bags for all your yarn. And then of course you've got the other cute things too, like mugs and things like that. And all of the accessories that you need. I also saw, and there's a photo of it, I think there's a mug that said knitting is my superpower. I saw that too, that I caught that my was, attention yes. right away. I thought that was really so. cute. So I think a great, a great idea uh, for, for those knitters and crafters. Yes, and then also um, you were saying that we have friends at Chickadee who yes. can help us with socks. Yes. But they also have a lot of cool things going 
going mm -hmm. on. So, of course, Chickadee, they're in uh, Perrysburg. Mm -hmm. They have things like wool winders, needle sets, other accessories. You were chatting with them. What were they kind of giving you insights on their gifts? Yeah, so, I, and I think you're going to mention this a little bit later with Creatively Altered, but the interchangeable needle sets. Yes. Which is a great gift, I think. Very for, You know, this way your knitter has all of the needles all in one yes. place. So that is, yep. that is a really good one. And then also, if you want to get them something that's already done, you could do like the hats or the slippers, the yes. funny little cozy things. Hand warmers uh, was another right. big one too. So that's uh, in Perrysburg, Chickadee. Yes, mm -hmm. and then uh, there's one thing that I had seen earlier, and it's not your traditional fiber gift, but it's very unique, huh? and it's at Natural Fiber and Yarn in Grand Rapids, Ohio. Oh, so it's these that? nesting balls Cute. for your birds, and so they have the fiber inside of them, so they're going to be great for, you know, the bird lover in your yeah. life. Maybe you're running out of time to make something. So um, they actually repel water and moisture mm -hmm. with the fiber in there. So it's just, I thought, a really neat gift, but also still fiber related because sure. it's a fiber art that we're talking about. Absolutely. Um, and then they also had their um, some dryer balls. Yes, which is funny because we were talking about my hack with the dryer sheets earlier in the show. A lot of people commented on that and said, I use dryer balls because they're just not toxic, <laughs> like yes. dryer sheets. Yes. So, so it's interesting, you can go buy a dryer ball. <laughs> yeah, and they, they do help your, they do help to improve your dryer time. Yeah. They kind of get everything shaken in there. So for your wool and fiber mm -hmm. friends, you have gift options there. Yeah. And then another store we have, um, Tink and the Frog from Adrian. Adrian. They sent us, they also had um, the interchangeable needles, Ooh. but here's a hat that's been pretty popular. I like um, that. Yes, as far as their knitters there, their knitters have been calling them the perky little hat, yeah. um, which I think that's the perfect name. So that's I been pretty so popular Look there. at that pom-pom. Yeah, that's a great, that's a fur. That's, yes. that's furlicious. Um, but also, yes, they have the interchangeable needle sets. Mm -hmm. so that that's, is, what, that's a closer look at what they look like. So yes, you can so put it all together in one spot. Yeah, very popular. A lot of people are talking about that. And then I loved this one. They have a mug and I'm like, oh my goodness, it's so funny. So it says, a question asked while I was counting stitches, sti stitches will be answered with louder counting. Exactly. Yeah, one, one, two, two three. three. I do yeah. it every time. All we the time. all do you it. You can't lose track. You can't. We I love all that. do it. So that was a lot of fun. Very cute. And then she also had a really cute yarn ball holder. Oh, okay. That was um, cute as oh, well. Look so at you that. can get a picture of that. Very and then cute. we also have Creatively Altered. So she's got project bags mm -hmm. that are going on. You um, never have too many of those. Yeah, right? to kind of keep them organized. This is also from Creatively Altered. I went shopping uh, there. So yeah, there's the project bags mm -hmm. uh, that she had shared with us. And also you can see, you know, your yarn arm ball holder but I uh, bought this little this little one when I was shopping there a few weeks ago so this is a gift um, so hopefully my family and friends aren't watching don't but watch it actually has um, some yarn in there uh -huh. a recipe card and a wooden spoon oh so she said people what are how did they go together so you make some dishcloths with them. You can make two oh. dishcloths with your yarn and then you make them up and gift them. But I thought I have a knitter in my life. I'm just gonna let them make their own dishcloths and then they can match the patterns you don't that they want. So you could go either way. And she said yeah. that everybody's kind of doing it both cool. ways. So I thought that was really cool. Yeah. Um, she also had locally hand dyed yarn, mm -hmm. she said is always we'll fun. Too. So mm -hmm. yeah, we brought in some yarn. So yeah, here's her little gift bags. There's the yarn uh, that she has. So of course if it's hand dyed, it's always fun because it's yeah. so unique. Mm -hmm. And then gadgets. All the gadgets you could possibly need to put in all of the bags and pouches that you have as well. Yes. So yeah. And of course, another thing that I thought of was yarn subscriptions. I'm sure all of these mm -hmm. local stores, if you want to do a yarn box or maybe like a, a box of yarn a month mm -hmm. for the, you know, knitter or crocheter in your life, I'm sure they'll help you out. None of them said that they would, but I know that but they're they so helpful. They will. Absolutely. Yes. And of course, show us what you are working on right now. We want to see your projects. You can, uh, you know, just drop them in on our Facebook page, send us messages, send us emails, whatever you want to do. We want to see what you're working on, especially yeah. this holiday season. Yeah. So let us know what you're uh, working on. Yeah. And, uh, of course, I'll get my prize. Yes, you got some more work to do. I need to get something on the needles, too. 